Welcome to another Enjoying Art Watercolor lesson. Today we're going to paint this rabbit, and we're going to show you the techniques to paint the fur. Before the masking, we need to plan the drawing. So take a look at where we're going to put the rabbit. So this is, would be the head, and the bottom over here, I'm going to plan it, and right down over here. The next thing I'm going to do is to doing the masking. Okay. Now prepare us to do the good masking. We need to have a brush. I'm using this calligraphy brush and I'm going to wet it and also have the soap bar. Okay, move around, let all the soap get into between the hairs. Okay, that's just good. That's good. Now I'm gonna put it down over here and ready. Now we get a little bit uh, art masking fluid from Winsor Newton. That's probably good enough. Okay, that's good. Now I'm going to dip it in, start from the tip of the ear. Look again. Okay, like that. That's good. Go just paint the way you're gonna do the painting. Okay, here you go. Make a little bit thicker. Okay, come over right here. Here you go, and the tip over here. I have another leg on the other side, like that. Now I'm gonna use a separate water to clean the brush. And that's very easy for the cleanup, that's it. The brush is back to a normal shape and ready for the next use. Okay, the masking food already dried. Now I'm going to start painting into the background. I'm going to mix a little bit more like a brown color. I'm going to take this. A brown color, that means you have all three colors together. And here you go. That's just a nice brown color. I need a lot more, so I get a little bit more water. At the same time, you gotta have a lot more paint, right? Or otherwise, it will be too light. So, some members talk about that. It's a little bit hard to control the water. This is not about hard to control the water. You need to spend more time when you're mixing colors. That's very important. Okay. Now, I'm gonna get even more water. Now it's you go. I'm going to start from here. This brush is very soft, so you can just paint over. It won't scratch any of those masking. Okay. Now put a little color over here. Drop in, make some variety. I also want to have a little bit water and splashes in the background. Okay. I try to make a little bit soft feeling. A little bit darker over here. Give a little bit a few texture. A little bit red going in here. Now I'm gonna turn into a little bit brown color. Yeah, here we go. That's just good. I'm gonna have a little brown color over here. Yeah, for example, like that. A little bit shape like this. Okay, a little bit. And here you go. Like that. And I also need to be a little bit like that as well. Now coming to the front over here. Now also getting dry already. So I'm gonna have to drop in. A big shape and a little bit, a little bit shape horizontal and a little bit shape vertical. Okay, and now we're gonna wait until it totally dry. I'm gonna come back to remove uh, the masking for it, and we're gonna walk into the main object. Now the paper already dry. And it's just going to lift up the masking layer. That's good. Almost done. Uh, 
that's good now everything is gone now we're going to start painting into the rabbit when we're painting the rabbit making sure we see the light and shadow in the shadow side we can see they have a little, little bit more blue color on the other side have a little bit more orange color it's not really really that bright okay and look at it again and maybe have a little bit blue that's just good now all right now i'm going to take this color put it into this ear on the back so when i paint this i'm making sure i leave a little light shape on both sides a little bit closer and thin there that's good i'm going to see a little gap over here and on the top and coming to okay come a little gap and coming over here a little gap and connect to the head here a little bit brown color right over here but it's a little bit darker like that and put it over here first and even a little bit more red a little bit more here okay that's good and coming a little bit more gray and coming in the middle there you go a little bit over there okay and get a little bit more at the front over here and we're going to use uh, a little bit more lighter red and here you go a little bit lighter red there you go a little bit lighter red like this think about the value very critical okay now that's good for now and we'll come back to do a little bit more later and this i'll come back to overlay a little bit color but i don't want these two color merge together a little bit too much okay that that's good and i can soften that out there we go that's good yes now now i'm gonna first overlay lay a little bit orange color at the top there's a little bit yellow a little bit like that a little bit lighter and also and the top and the back over here like a little bit like that that little shape that's good like this good. and then coming down over here so this is not just pure white okay now this use a little bit brighter color in the light side that's just good and we can soften the edge a little bit later okay here you go a little bit later when we come back to do adjusting okay now i'm going to continue covering uh the with a little bit red shade blue color i'm going to put it over here, over here. i'm going to take this color put it right here from a little bottom coming up here you go a little bit over here and see have a little bit more on this side because that is probably the um the catch the shadow from the ear now like this you see that that is a very beautiful okay now coming down over here and we need to uh soften that a little bit here i don't want that part just use the water tap on it that's good enough and i'm going to continue with this color with this a little bit more gray color here you got a little bit gray brown color coming down over here and the bottom over here is much darker so we're going to take the blue color and the red color together okay make that a little bit darker a little bit more red a little bit warmer here you go and i have that that's good that coming up and looking for the good. apply the color over here you can see this a little bit darker because of it's just a shadow at the bottom a little bit like that coming up over here okay now i'm gonna wait into wet keep going and i'm gonna looks like from this blue color coming over and to the shoulder over here 
and it's going to turn into a little bit more brown color but this little suggestions are the red shade of blue color is very helpful to make it feel like a lot more about the, the shadow side okay that's good have a little bit soft texture over here like that hey that's good i can see the form the little curve around the form right now i'm going to keep going to the other side i'm going to get a little bit yellow and and maybe a little bit brownish right so i'm going to take this red and take this a little bit blue color there you go a little bit more like that and coming in here let's take a look there's a little bit color there's a little bit shadow side coming down over here on the neck coming down like this yeah, so this color is a little bit darker than the outside over here like okay, here we go now coming over here uh, screen your eye to see how those value would look now coming on this side and a little bit more water wet into wet let it keep going and here you go a little bit blue as well and there softly connect that over softly connect that over like that here you go coming down here and i have a little bit a little bit brownish warm color at the bottom here here you go now also over here merge that all together and the same color and have this also move the color make a little bit softer coming down over here that's good if you have some texture it probably even better because that it will be look like a feather right i can have a little bit more like extra i'm going to make some really dark color on the other ear okay that's good like that here you go right over here look at it okay that's good all right like this I'm going to soften this area. You see how I make shape the brush to be like a small flat brush. I'm just going to soften this. It will look like the ear does fur. Okay. See that? Just a little bit softer. That's it. Don't have to do hair by hair. Okay, here you go. Into the eye over here. That's good. Like that. We shape it even darker. I'm gonna have a little bit darker color. A little bit darker blue. Okay, just shape it at the bottom. Okay, again. That's good. And looking at the eye and the top have a little bit blue color coming down. Okay, there's a little bit blue color. I'm going to take a little blue color. And that blue color may be a little bit too much blue, but I'm going to see. A little bit gray like that. And coming here. Look at the top. And yeah, a little bit blue. Also lighter. Okay. After it dries, I come back to finish the eye area. Coming over here, continue. That's good. The bottom over here, so darker than inside the iris. That's good. Beautiful. That's good. Okay. Now take a look on this side. This is already good on this side. Okay. Now I'm gonna make some even darker color. Okay. The top have a little bit more blue, and the bottom have a little bit more red. And at the top over here, have a little bit more blue. Here you go. Yes. A little bit oval shape. Look at it again. Okay. Like that. And then going to the bottom. And yeah, look at it again. That's good. I think it can be even a little bit bigger. Now, the bottom. Don't go all the way to that bottom. Just like. 
Uh huh. I think that's just fabulous. That's just good. Okay. And a few texture over here. Now I can coming back to uh, shade the the white shape around the eye a little bit dimmer, and we get a little bit more of this this kind of warm gray color. Here you go. Make that a little bit softer, so that light shape is not going to stand out too much. That's good. Something like that. Okay. Yeah, a little bit softer. Okay, that's good. And the top, a little bit lighter. So I clean my brush. Here you go. Soften that a little bit over. And I also want this area a little bit softer in the transition. Okay, there like this. 